just listening to Tristan Harris on Joe Rogan, uh, one of the people responsible for The Social Dilemma, um, a very good documentary uh, about the ills of a attention-based economy fueled by endless growth model mega corporations, which is what we have now with uh, Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and so forth. Uh, make sure I'm going the right direction. It was straight. Um, and it makes me remember how important an idea that I've had for many years is, and that is the gift economy. I want to start a social media platform wherein the currency is connectivity and the stock and trade is, I uh, almost got hit by a semi, that wouldn't have been good, uh, is your gifts. So you register online, uh, you make a profile, and you simply say what you uh, have to give freely to the community. The algorithms and AI uh, and powers that be on the back end computing link you up to a small circle and uh, allow you to give your gift. It can be product, service, information, what have you. The problem that all of the social media companies are running into, in my opinion, is that they rely on a uh, capitalist mentality of currency and therefore advertising dollars, which is the currency at play online, being the end-all be-all of uh, the formula, the, the, the bottom line the formula is trying to optimize for. And I would argue that we're social creatures and we want to give our gifts to the community. That's something innate, I, I would argue. It's what allows a person to feel like they're part of the community is the degree to which they can give. Anybody that's hardcore capitalist says, you know, provide value, provide value. Right, fair enough. I contend that using the powers that be on uh, social media, um, landscape, back-end computing, algorithmic uh, content delivery and so forth uh, for a system based on gifts, gifting, call it the gift economy, an idea that I understand is present at Burning Man, never been, but I've heard that that's the case, and elsewhere, uh, I think could be uh, sensationally successful. Uh, I don't have the capital right now nor the connections to build this. It's something that I've had in my brain for over a decade. I know it would be successful. I know it will be successful as soon as somebody builds it correctly. I've seen a lot of attempts at the same kind of idea that have been successful to different degrees. Free cycle, communityexchange.org. Uh, websites based on free sharing of goods and services. Uh, I've seen several pop up um, that have some kind of proxy for currency, whether it's time or some kind of you know online coin or something. And I just think that those are are unsophisticated representations of capitalism, and that it will eventually lead to one person having all the resources on on the platform. And the way around that is to have a simple free sharing website. Uh, call it the gift economy, you log on, you say, hey, I'm Devin, I can give swim lessons or ski lessons to anybody on you know Tuesday and Thursday afternoons, and I just let my profile sit there, you know, and the platform links me up to people in my geographical area that want that service or are willing to uh, try that service. Um, there's no money exchanged. It's just a goodwill generator as opposed to a polarization generator, which is what we have now. Uh, I think that the mechanism by which it would be extremely addictive, which is the, again, another stock and trade of social media, is that the more people that participate in my gift, that, that you know, that receive my gift, the larger my network becomes. So, I want to build it, 
I think that the world needs it. You listen to Tristan Harris on Joe Rogan. You watch The Social uh, Dilemma. You listen to people that you know see the uptick in depression, anxiety, text neck, uh, suicide, anorexia, all of these problems associated with social media and children now. And you realize that we, we have a problem. We have our psychology being fiddled with by huge organizations dealing in tens of billions of dollars a year, I think it's fair to say, that have no incentive to do what is right or moral or good uh, for humanity. They're generated, uh, they're rather, they're motivated by profit generation. So I wanted to put this message out there. I'm on the way to uh, work at a wildland fire, the North Complex in Quincy, California. This is my second wildland fire as an EMT. I'll be working on an ambulance. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm trying to do good in my life because I see the degree to which wealth accumulation and manipulation in terms of social and online uh, corrodes the soul of the individual and I refuse to be corroded. Uh, I'd rather spend my time working to be a fit, healthy, grounded, put together version of myself. And this is an idea I've had for a long time and I think it needs to manifest. Um, I've searched for it several times. I've, I think I've seen the gift economy pop up uh, here and there. Uh, just wanted to put the idea out there. Uh, if you're watching this, please uh, drop a comment and let me know what you think. Much love, everybody. Thank you for watching.